I'm pleased to introduce the new Mega Model SMRT36 relay test set with the STVI Smart Touch View Interface Controller. The SMRT36 is the next generation of advanced microprocessor based relay test sets from Megger. It's reflective of Megger's 60 years of experience in the development and the manufacturing of protective relay test equipment. Okay, let's test that Westinghouse ABB C09 relay. We're going to go to the timing test screen. I'm going to come over here to setup and settings. I'm going to come over here to the curve characteristic. I'm going to select the ABB Westinghouse and I'm going to select C09. It's on number three time dial, so that's good. We'll leave that there. Okay. And uh, the pickup value is set on a five amp tap, so we'll enter five. The instantaneous is set at 30 amps. Okay, that's it. Okay. So now we're going to use current channel number one to supply our 10 amps, which would be two times the five amp tap. And you'll notice it's two, four, and six, but we can set them to anything we like. Let's set them to two, three, and four. So we're going to do three points on the curve, two, three, and four times tap. Okay. I'm going to come over here. I'm going to select binary input number one. And it's set to go from normally open to close. And I need to select latch. And the debounce time is set for two milliseconds. Okay, we're ready to do the test. So all we have to do now is press the play button. It's applying the test current to the relay, which is 10 amps, looking for the relay to operate. And when the relay operates, we capture the test result. So it tripped in 4.084 seconds. Since the result is within the manufacturer's time curve characteristic, it gives us a green dot. Now we're going to wait a, a second or two for the disk to reset and the disk is reset. So now I'm going to come over and I'm going to do three times tap. And so it should be applying 15 amps to the relay and the relay operates and we get another test result. Okay, the disk is reset and now we'll do four times tap. And it'll apply 20 amps to the relay and you could hear the, uh, the groaning in the uh, instantaneous coil. So there's our three test points on the curve. If we want to add a fourth or fifth point, we can do that. Let's go ahead and save those results, including report. And here we can see the results for our timing test. At two, three, and four times tap, there's the test current, the trip time, the theoretical, the min, the max, and whether it passed, and it passed all points, and we see the three test points on the curve. Thank you for your time. Should you have any questions, please contact your local mega sales rep. See contact information at the bottom of the screen.